today we are at the Twinsburg Ohio Goodwill. Uh, again, part of the Akron group. Sorry. I just ate some hot fries. So, let's go inside. Let's go see the store. Here's the records over here. Okay, it's very quiet. Here's the book section. Um, all books are $1.50. Uh, media records are $2.50. Smaller ones are $1.50. They have this grouping here in the middle of new stuff. And then here along the wall, they have some of their items color-coded. So we start here with the red, yellow, green, blue, and we'll work our way down. TJ Maxx little plate, plastic for $2. marked on a teapot. <laughs> I wonder if it had like tippet accessories. A little swan here for two dollars with a candle in it. Okay and then we're here more in the blue and green and pink purple-ish Ayo, um, Manny Ramirez bobblehead for four hours. This is a really pretty just little house here. It is cold painted, it's chipping on the inside for 75 cents. Um, some more pink. We have this Cocktail Lane Fire Station house for two dollars. Uh. has been my weakness. I will pick it up because it goes with the co the rest of the cocktail lane stuff that I do have. Um, while we're looking this way, here's their basket section. And then we move into like the wood section here with the yellows. And some wood. Um, just some more home decor type items. This here says crystal wine glasses. Very pretty. All right. We'll move right down the aisle. Keep on going straight down. 75 cents for that lovely. It's very pretty with the pattern on it. Okay. Got a little sleepy cat here sits on the shelf like that. Cute. Little owl ornament for 75. And then we got the metal section. And then down into the electronics, lamps. This is a really pretty glazed lamp. I don't see a price on it. Let me look. Yeah, I don't see a price on that. But this one here is five, but I'm sure I'm assuming this would be more. Alright, we got some glasses here, stemware. Somewhere it looks to be 75 cents. It's really pretty purple ones. Dollar twenty-five. And I got a whole bunch of mugs. Seventy-five cents a piece. 
Nice big variety of stuff. Quite a lot to look through here on the shelves. Thailand. Oh, teacher Disney World mug. A lot of utensil marks inside, but some barkeeper's friend would take that right out. Okay, so it's a German Christian Christmas market, dollar twenty-five. And we got some fall items here on the edge of this one. Little pumpkins. Some little Santa Clauses back here. Alright, and then we've got some plates here. Some like sets at the bottom and then like individual plates, glass and ceramic at the top. Ikea. I love Ikea. Little taper candles. So this is like their little electronics area where they have the remotes. Stuff in boxes, little lamps, DVD players, things like that. Alright, I'm gonna look here. Alright, and we got like a rug dresser. It's a nice mid century dresser at the feet. Neon shabby. Rug there for fifteen dollars. Nice big mirrors for ten. Then we've got the big artwork back here in the back, and then some smaller ones here. It looks to be three dollars, two dollars. This big here is five. Yeah. And with those big furniture here, we've got some more stands, golf club bag, couple couches. Nine foot for ten dollars. I'm gonna call my sister and ask her. Linens, storage thing for top of the car, and then clothes. And we've got another Anna cap here with some Christmas. All right, and we've got another items here that are more just than Christmas. And then I'm gonna go get the clock, okay? Got the utensils and kitchen items, pans, things here. And then over here, we just got some more kitchen items. All right. And then here we've got the clear glass bottles, faces, things of that nature. I always look for apothecary jars. Um, I've been starting to decorate my Halloween with apothecary jars, so yeah. I'm gonna look through here. These are 50 cents a piece. I'm gonna look through here and see what I can find. Kids clothes toys are up on top like they have been. Some more food toys here for $1.25. Hot dog french fries. Yeah, he has all that. It's a good price though, $1.25.
clothes. We don't need clothes. We have clothes. We have a bin of pillows, three forty nine. Some stuffed animals here. A horse. Here <laughs> it says I work two dollars. Oh, there's some more toys just here in the end cap. Dollar twenty-five seventy-five cents. Yeah. We'll go down this way. Got a big Harry Potter doll in there. $3 for the Buzz Lightyear, Deadpool, and Harry Potter. Let's get back to small animals there. The Scar for $3. for two dollars. A little train set. Electric train set for three dollars. Okay. So we tore that bag open. Here of some backpacks, Harley Davidson bag, threads, and got a high state bag, some items, and some more bags and scarves. Looks like they're gonna put these out. That's cool. And then we got some dresses back here. Well, prom dresses, wedding dresses. Nice, nice, nice. All right, and we got their shoes up here. We're gonna look at these and then we're gonna head out the door. They're all individually priced, I do believe. No? Oh, the signs are down here. Shoes 249, boots and ang ankle boots 349, sandals dollar forty nine. That's pretty good prices. Then we got their little basket of umbrellas here, which is nice. Cool. All right, we just got done with where am I at? Twinsburg. <laughs> Twinsburg Goodwill. Uh, manager inside was at least the guy that said hi to me at the door. It was very, very nice. Um, I did not get his name. I do apologize. I'm sorry. I'm really bad about asking names. Um, they were even having a sale on holiday items. There was a nine foot tree back there. I'll put a picture um, showing the branches because it had like pine cones on it. Really nice quality tree. It was only $10 and it was on sale. So it would have only been like $7.50. That is the hardest part for me is to find good deals like that when I know stuff like that costs more. And for me to leave it. That's the hardest part for me. But my sister does not need. She said she's already got a trait. 
anyway, uh, very nice store. Um, they had a lot to look at. The first bit of the hard goods section was a little sparse. I did find another cocktail house, ceramic house for my Easter stuff. And then I found a couple little ornaments, um, in a little ornament bin. So, um, just a couple little things here. That's it. That's all I found. Um, it was a very nice store. It's a lot bigger inside than what it looks like. So, thank you guys for watching this episode of the Twinsburg, Ohio Goodwill. Um, we're moving on. One more for the day. And then you guys will have to wait and see that in a couple of days. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe. And please embrace your thrifty soul. Bye.